hello everybody. I am coming to you live from my workplace because today I have a very special video. Um, I am currently filming this portion on October 28th of 2022. So hello from past me. Um, but today is the first day that I am truly working on building out space for the serpent's key. Ah! Um, so I talked with my boss last week on the 21st, super nerve wracking, was very concerned about doing it. There was a new moon. I was just like, oh my gosh, this is, it's now or never, right? So basically at work, we had an extra room and um, I talked to my boss. I just approached her about, you know, maybe I could rent that out and start doing my tarot readings. So at the beginning of October, I had a live tarot event and I, <laughs> I'm gonna say I did pretty well for myself. I'm gonna toot my own horn a little bit. And I really was inspired by that and encouraged by that. And all of my coworkers were just super nice and encouraging of me as well, um, that I <laughs> plucked up the courage just to ask my boss if I could use the extra room that we have here um, in order to set up and maybe even prototype my shop a little bit. So. Um, I drew up a blueprint. I gave her a, just like a quick little summary of like, hey, here's what I can do. Here's my plan. Can I do it? And she immediately said yes, because like, oh, I just, I adore her. So, and yes, she built this whole studio. She's just like the coolest, most inspiring and creative person I've ever met. So I'm so stoked that she took a chance on me and that she gave me this chance to like, I don't know, just be. So I am super grateful to Missy for like giving me this chance. And um, yeah, anyways, I'm gonna stop rambling and I'm gonna show you the room that's soon to be mine. <laughs> okay, so currently we are using this room as like storage and staging for a huge convention we were going to. So it's a little bit messy, but um, I'm gonna show you the little space. There's lots of stuff up here that I'm going to tidy up. I put some paint swatches over there already because I am a monster, but um, today I'm going to clean all of this up. I'm going to be my Virgo self. And um, yeah, I'm actually really excited. <laughs> Everybody, this was already here, which is super cool, but da da da. I cleaned everything up. It's very echoey here. <laughs> this cute little alcove and everything kind of that way of that tape line is where I'm going to be setting up my little my stuff. So, da da da. The first iteration begins. <laughs> okay, so it is the end of week two of me building out my space, and you guys can see I put all of the painter's tape down for like the baseboards. These are some tapestries I got. But yeah, I just wanted to pop on and update everybody. Um, so today is when I'm recording this, obviously, um, is November 11th, so it is 11-11. <laughs> um, and actually yesterday um, was my boss's first day back in the shop after she was doing some conventions. And I showed her like all of the progress. I just like went through everything and I think she was a little bit afraid of me. <laughs> Um, no, I'm kidding, but, um, but basically she and I sat down like quite literally on this rug, um, and she is offering me more space possibly. So like, um, and she also was like, oh, and I'm also going to be expanding this room a little bit further. So I'll have more space than I was expecting, which is very exciting. Um, I'm like so stoked about that. And um, yeah, I'm just, I'm really happy. But let me show you some of the stuff that I brought in um, this week. So week three, I guess. Actually, I just realized this is the end of week three. So this is like what I did last week. Um, and then this week I've done more online stuff. Um, getting my new website set up, getting um, my booking stuff set up. I signed up for Square, got my little card reader. It's super cute. Um, but basically, yeah, that's kind of where I'm at right now. And it's exciting. I don't know. <laughs> Rec was $10 on Facebook Marketplace. Um, I got some really cute tapestries. I got these on Amazon. Then I have my Magic the Gathering, like Targaryen mat um, from like college. I have this super cute little bat shelf. Got some lights, that's a drop cloth for painting, ignore it. Um, then I have just like all of this stuff that I'm going to be adding. So next I'm going to be painting the walls. <laughs> so it is the first week of December. I opened in about a month, so it is definitely time to start getting things all finished, right? So I just wanted to show you guys kind of like the space that I have so far. Um, a lot of this stuff I honestly found on like Facebook Marketplace, so um, it looks pretty neat, um, but I, I'm, I pride myself on finding things that look cool for very little money. So um, got some really cool stuff. I'm going to be painting that and there's tons of stuff stored in there. Um, and then I got this other little shelf full of witchy things and that is my painting stuff. Um, 
I'm painting the room this really beautiful color called Spirit Blue. Um, and I'm really excited about that. As you guys can see, I ooh, that's the storage area. Ignore that. Uh, but I've been spackling the walls and um, yeah, I'm gonna start painting tomorrow. So stay tuned. everybody welcome back i just wanted to update you guys um it is now december 19th so it's been about two weeks since i last checked in um lots of stuff going on so i have the final coat of paint on the walls i had a little bit of a disaster last weekend where it was a little bit patchy so i finally finished that um i'm gonna let this dry for a couple hours and then we're gonna do the gold trim i'm so excited um you guys can probably see some of my little furniture pieces so that is like um um, one of the altar pieces that I have here is another altar and then that oh my gosh if you guys can see it I found that I snagged it for like a massive deal I couldn't believe that I got my hands on it but I bought myself a Morticia chair and I have literally wanted this thing since I was like 13 years old so um I'm really stoked and that's what I'm going to use to sit and do all of my readings in um and it's just really exciting it's really nice to like get stuff for yourself I don't know I just it was it was nice to treat myself I don't often do that so um anyways um I am going to let this dry and hopefully get out of the paint fumes um and then I will check in with you guys later bye so for the entirety of January, I was really struggling to keep up with filming for this video. So please just enjoy some pictures that I have of myself, of the shop. Um, this is our community altar space for one of our full moon celebrations, as well as one of our fabulous vendors. Um, so you can see I kind of had some curtains up dividing the room as well. Um, thank you so, so much to everyone who did stop in in that first month. It really made a difference and it was really exciting to see um, just people be excited about this place it's nice um there's some more of those like boxes and stuff i always like to decorate things i don't like to have cardboard boxes around this is really like the best picture of what it looked okay, like before and so here we, go. we are expanding and as you can see this is all tattoo shop storage stuff so we're going to by we me i'm going to clear all of this out and move it into a different room and i will show you guys that in just a second It is now the end of February and I wanted to give you guys an update on my space because it has definitely changed. So let me show you how I rearranged everything. Okay, so as we enter in, we have obviously so much more space, lots of mess in that corner. So we're just going to get ahead of it. I know. Um, but as you can see, we have pocket bean over here. Lots of fun stuff. All of my cat tarot card um <laughs> tapestries and i have this really gorgeous shelf that missy gave me which is my boss and um i'm going to have some like live plants here so i'm super stoked about that that is some spell supplies ignore that some books that i have to put away in our lending library so if people have books that they no longer read or no longer serve their path but like don't know what to do with them. Um, you know, it's here for people to swap books out, you know, offload things that no longer serve them. I have a bunch of cool antiques, my little red filming chair. Um, this is of course where I read tarot and that is that really cool tapestry, the Mukha one. I obviously still need to iron it. Hello, there's me. I'm very cold. I'm still in my jacket. Um, but then of course we have all of the um, jewelry over here. Then I have some more vendors coming in, so these are going to be filled up really soon. I work with an animal shelter or a cat sanctuary, basically, to gather donations, to help the kitties, you know, cat food, cat litter, all that good stuff. Then I have some crystals and some stickers that I made, as well as some gorgeous candles here. And that is something that I also am still working on. Um, we have our community altar. That needs to go obviously up on the wall still, so still things to do. Um, these are some pre-loved altar tools that I have that are gonna be like majorly discounted. These are things that I thought I was gonna use but just never did. Um, and then I have my little altar for the Morrigan in here as well because she's my matron and I love her. So, so for having worked at this since like late October, uh, so like 
five months ish. Um, I'm pretty proud of what I have going on for me. Again, that is a very messy corner, so we're just gonna ignore it. Um, but I am really, really like proud and excited and I'm really stoked to see where this goes in the next six months because this wasn't even here. Um, so thank you guys for just like following me along in the journey. It's, you know, always cool to have people who are like egging me on or like um, giving me encouragement. So if that has been you, I appreciate you. Just know that. Um, and without further ado, I will see you guys in the shop. Bye. <laughs>